hello you guys and welcome to the channel so i do realize that my channel is a niche one however i am planning to um to start a beginner series in which i show you guys how you can do uh, genetic engineering and molecular biology at home so uh, i will be focusing more on dui stuff like uh, things that uh, that you can do yourself and uh, of course they're gonna be so inexpensive it's unbelievable so without further ado today i'm gonna show you how you can build a simple and inexpensive okay so first thing you're gonna need a cotton pad uh, this uh, you will uh, use for your wick. Of course, you can uh, use any cotton material that you got lying around. The second thing is you're gonna need a tin foil. So, of course, this is the, the cheaper version with uh, something you could uh, have laying around in your house. However, you could also use like a metal tube. I'll, uh, I'll post, uh, post the alternative here. Another thing you're gonna need you're gonna need a container right I am using again from my wife this is just a leftover scented candle that I removed the wax from so uh, you got the container and you got the lid you'll also need something that you can use to, uh, to poke a hole with I do have my Swiss Army knife right here you're gonna need of course a lighter and of course you're gonna need some uh, some alcohol I am using uh, because this uh, was the only thing uh, laying around uh, sanitary alcohol so this is basically 70% ethanol but you can also use and it's highly recommended to use like 90% or above alcohol but in a pinch you can also use like I don't know vodka whiskey and uh, and stuff like that okay so let me show you how you can build one First, we're gonna need to, to poke a hole in this uh, lid right here. I am gonna use the reamer. Of course, you can use whatever. And then you're gonna need to poke another a different hole right here so this is just to, uh, to release pressure from the from the fuel within what I'll do right now is basically create a wick out of cotton as I told you you can use uh, some any time of type of cotton fabric and material but I'm just gonna do something like this and uh, try to make a make a wick right here this should not be so hard Okay, so here we have a makeshift wick. You can basically twist it until you get that wick. Now the next thing, I'm going to use this tin foil just to create something that I can wick through. Let me see if I can get this 
to work. I'm gonna put this in multiple layers, right? Let's say we got something like this, like this. Okay. And then we're gonna make it round. round ish let me see what we've got here This isn't hard, but you know how it is. Let me just grab some kind of pencil. We're gonna put some alcohol in here. Now this cotton will get soaked. Voila! Now, 
in order to turn this off, because you're gonna need to turn it off, right? What you'll need to do is create like a like something, a lid. And I can use, of course, the tin foil for that. And it's out. Of course, you can light it again if you want. So this is how you build a Uber inexpensive. Uh, alcohol lamp. <laughs>